If you are in the market for a new or even a, a used car, you may have noticed higher than usual prices. Turns out now may not be the best time to buy, but it certainly is the best time to sell. So why it's happening? Here's Jerry Carnes. These days, cars are a bit like a fine wine that becomes more valuable with age. Sure, it's lost some of its shine, but a used car is more desirable than a vintage Bordeaux. Demand is up, supply is down, and the price of a used car has increased more than 20% over the past year. Let's look at why. The nation's economy has struggled during the pandemic, and while we appear to be on the road to recovery, financial expert Jenai Thornton says many Americans remain unsure. With these record levels of unemployment and financial anxiety, a lot of people have been encouraged to buy used or simply just not buy a new car at all. A microchip shortage has slowed the production of new cars, driving even more people toward used. Financial expert Andrew Poulos says extremely low interest rates on a car loan make buying something quite appealing. 1.99% starting at 1.99 is upwards of 2.45. I mean, that's dirt cheap money relatively, right? So uh, that's just propelling uh, and exasperating the, the issue of uh, demand. Further complicating the supply side are the people deciding it's a good time to hang on to their used car instead of buying something new. Early on in the pandemic, when there were lockdowns and very little travel, rental car companies began to sell off some of their fleet. Now they're trying to restock and they're in the hunt for used cars. They're out here desperately looking for cars, so they are creating some challenges in the used car market. Thornton says if you've got an extra vehicle, it's a great time to think about selling it. By the way, despite some supply challenges, new car prices have increased only about 2% over the past year.